Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be sharing a deep cleaning of my master bedroom. I have not honestly deep cleaned our master bedroom for a long time, so it's definitely in need of it. Our bedroom's not that messy. There's actually not a lot to pick up, but there's a lot to clean. I have a lot of dust to remove. I have a little bit of organization to do, so that's what's on the agenda today. My daughter, who is 17 months old, is currently taking a nap, so I need to work fast and efficient. If you guys do like cleaning videos like this, make sure to give that video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. Anyways, let's get started. Got the feeling from the start, you might be the guy who break my heart alone. All right, so here's the before of our bedroom. Like I said earlier, it's really not that messy or it doesn't appear that messy, but there is a lot of dust and that's what I'm gonna be focusing on today is getting out all of that dust from our bedroom. Also doing a little bit of organization and also doing those three laundry baskets full of laundry. Yes, three baskets. You guys, I have dropped the ball on laundry this week, so I really am behind. The best way to clean your mattress is to actually vacuum it. So I'm using my brand new Shark Ion Flex vacuum to do this. I've actually partnered with Shark for this video and you guys, I'm so obsessed with this vacuum. Seriously been a game changer when it comes to my cleaning routine. This is actually my favorite feature right here. The fact that this turns into a handheld vacuum for easy lightweight cleaning is phenomenal you guys. This is seriously so nice, especially when having a toddler. It's great to be able to use in my home like this, but it is also so nice to be able to take this into my car as well and clean up any crumbs for my daughter eating in my car. I also really love that this shark vacuum is bagless and also cordless. It does come with two removable batteries, so you're never going to run out of power, which is really nice. Next, I'm just going to make my bed, and I do want to mention if you guys see anything in my bedroom that you're liking, furniture wise, whatever, I'm going to try to link as much as I can down below so you guys can check it out if you have questions. I'm going to be cleaning almost everything in my room with my Mrs. Meyers all-purpose spray and the scent mint. This is probably one of my favorites at the moment. I'm really, really liking it. This is actually the first time I've tried mint, but I do get all of my cleaning products from Grove Collaborative. If you guys haven't checked out Grove Collaborative, you need to. It's seriously such a nice service. You order all of your cleaning products online and they ship them right to your door. I do actually have a way for you guys to save some money too, so if you guys are interested in Grove Collaborative, you can check the link down below. I'm going through my nightstand and organizing it a little bit better because it was getting kind of cluttered. I hadn't done this for a while, so it was definitely a need. Next, I'm just going to wipe down my lamps and just make sure everything is free of dust. Moving on to my dresser, I'm going to pick up everything and then wipe everything down really well with my all-purpose spray. My dresser is white so it does get dirty pretty fast, especially with sticky fingers around my house and my daughter's always trying to come in my dresser and pull out all of my clothes. It's a fun game to her. Not very fun for me, but she loves to do it. So I'm going to get this wiped down really well. I also made a rookie mistake here. Whenever you are cleaning, you want to start from top to bottom. So I actually should have cleaned my TV first so I'm not having to clean up the dust that's fallen from the TV. So I did have to go through and just wipe down my dresser again after I cleaned off the TV. So I took everything off of these shelves, I have two shelves right here, and I am just giving these a good dust and then I'm going to wipe down all of the decor. 
pour on there and then stick everything back where it goes. I should also probably mention the rags that I'm using are also from Grove Collaborative and they are a microfiber dust rag and they are seriously amazing. I don't know why I've never used these in the past. I just started using them in the past couple months and they really help capture the dust and just clean a little bit more efficiently. You and I side by side, knowing there is more in life that I want. I'm pulling out my shark vacuum again to clean up my chair. I do have some crumbs in this chair. My daughter actually crumbled a cracker into this chair the other day and I guess I didn't get it all cleaned up so I wanted to make sure I got all of the crumbs out. Then I'm going to just clean up this little area and I'm also going to vacuum this area so I can put it back together but I do like to vacuum lastly but this area was an exception I guess. I can see so much So like I said earlier, I totally dropped the ball on doing laundry this week. I was so bad about it. All of this stuff has been sitting here for a couple days and it just drives me crazy that I let that happen, but we're all human and we can't stick to a schedule every single day. Ideally, I really like to try to do a load of laundry a day. It really does help things. So if you guys are struggling keeping up with laundry, I'd really recommend trying to do a load of laundry a day. And it is a game changer. And I am going to challenge myself to really get back into the routine of doing that every single day. Okay, so now I just need to put all the laundry away. It seriously feels like that took like five hours, but that's all right. I'm going to be putting all of Scarlett's clothes in her laundry basket, so it's really easy just to put away when she wakes up. But I did laundry pretty fast because I am going to be traveling, so a lot of this stuff is just going straight into my suitcase. So I'm just putting everything that I am bringing with us in my suitcase now, and I don't have to put it away, so it kind of saves me from packing. I don't know how I shiver inside Doesn't show, but my nerves are inside out It's because you're not worth less than perfection so this is the other project that took up majority of my time today. This took so long, but it so needed to be done. These blinds are awful to clean, but I just took my duster and kind of ran it down vertically, and then I'm going through with my rag. I also want to mention that instead of directly spraying the blinds with all-purpose spray, I'm actually spraying my rag, and then I'm using that to clean the remaining dust off of the blinds. I'm also going to wipe down all of the areas around the windows, and then I'm also going to take my all-purpose spray and just clean all of the little cracks and crevices and then I'm going to use my Mrs. Meyers glass cleaner to clean the windows. While I'm over here, I'm also going to give my fiddle leaf tree that's artificial a good wipe down just to get all the dust off of the leaves. This does collect dust and it's really easy to clean. You just kind of forget to do it sometimes. So I did want to make sure I did that today. Now I'm cleaning the very last blinds in my room. I'm so happy this is done. Like I said, these were not fun to clean. I want to hold your body close to me. I want to take you where you never be. Next, I'm cleaning all of my baseboards, all of my doors, and light sockets in the room, giving these a good wipe down. I forget how dirty these get, so these were definitely in need of this today. Next, 
I'm going to clean all of my mirrors in my bedroom. Again, I'm using the Mrs. Myers glass spray. The multiplex technology that these shark vacuums have are unreal. You guys, look how easy it is to clean under my bed. I absolutely love this feature. It is so handy. The very last thing I'm going to do is change my shark vacuum to the handheld vacuum one more time and just go around the edges of my bedroom making sure I got all of the dust. Thank you guys so much for watching today's cleaning video. I really hope it gave you some sort of inspiration to clean some room in your house, maybe even your master bedroom. If you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. If you want to follow along with us even more, follow us over on Instagram, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.